Morning, 17th of June, 2022. I haven't got day with me this morning. I've done a bit of wheeling and dealing and I've got Mr. Sunak to come and have a few words. Morning. Morning, morning, morning Richie. Morning, morning, How are you doing? Oh, take it about, take it about, John. We've been taking uh, questions off people at Rotherham. That's okay by me, John. I've got, uh, I've got one or two questions. I have nothing to add, John. How did you cook, become a multimillionaire by the age of 42? I'll, t I'll tell you how, uh, John, and it's easy really, anybody can do it. Sheer hard work, graft, not seven and a half hour shifts, 12, 12 hours, sometimes 14, sometimes 16 hours. Hard work, so from the day I left school up to now, I've never stopped working and earning, let me add. Ah, right, right, right. Why, why do you need to work then if you've got all this money? Money? I'm not doing it for the money. Uh, I'm doing it because it's my duty to get this country back on its feet. We've gone through a pandemic and uh, we've, we've spent a lot of money and now we're going to get it back in and you're going to pay whether you like it or not. Right, you're the first Chancellor in memory of a man to be fined uh, through Portugal. Oh yeah, well that's it, see. I didn't agree with the fine. Have you considered resigning? Oh no, no, not for one minute. I'm not resigning, but the thing is, I did pay the fine under duress, but what it was, I thought you know, I were attending a work meeting. We, we were, well, well, obviously, I, 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 obviously, I'm a workmate for this, so why won't it be a work meeting? Uh, uh, uh. You and your missus have been accused of tax evasion. Oh. Have you uh, have you ever evaded tax, paying taxes? Well, hand on heart, I must say this. I've not paid... I have paid my taxes, but I've got an American uh, citizenship, so I pay tax over there, same as my wife. She pays tax in India. We have paid some tax here, but... We paid all the taxes we should have paid, but we've not paid them all yet. Oh, you know, like, yeah, 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 there yeah. was no interest. It's no good having your, mo you. no good having your money in a bank in England where you're going to have to pay tax on the interest. So if you go over to uh, to uh, Virgin Virgin Isles or somewhere uh, like that, uh, 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 stick it out there. You don't pay any tax on interest. You get a better interest rate or not, to be honest. Uh, uh, you spent a lot of public money during the pandemic. Yeah, yeah. Do you think it's been well spent? Oh, absolutely well spent. We got the world beating second says for thirty-seven billion. Uh, we got the uh, furlough. Furlough. We've, we've kept loads of small firms afloat and big firms and all. Okay, we've been. Uh, yeah, 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 we yeah. know people have wrongfully claimed, but we, you're always going to get that. It was a massive, massive enterprise what we did, and I, I'm actually very, very proud of the money I have spent. It's, it's come to our. our uh... Well, we've been we've been told that you lost eleven billion pounds. Do you know where it's gone? <laughs> oh well, I've a rough idea, but to be honest, uh, John, what happens if you've got a thousand pound in your pocket and you lose eleven pound? You'll not even know it's missing. It's the same for me. But instead of talking a thousand pound, let's say a thousand billion. You lose a th you have a thousand billion in your pocket. And you lose eleven billion. It's a drop in the ocean. Get over it. Move on. How long before you and your wife are, 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 will actually be billionaires then? Well, between me and you, John. Uh, you're already a billionaire. Oh, you? yeah, twice over. Especially, well, with £11 billion, I'll put it that way. <laughs> oh, sorry, John. Uh, I know that you, you're not going to be going for leadership at party, but well, have you got a message for British people? Yeah, to the British people, we've all got to knuckle down, work harder. Work harder, work for less. Uh, it's no good striking for more money. There is no more money. Uh, all the money is going to to the uh, corporations and that. So oh, there's yeah, only yeah, enough. Yeah. There's no magic money in the words of Mrs. May. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right, right. And uh, I'm just looking. That's a very nice T-shirt. Where did you get that from? Well, this is. You know what, John? Beautiful. <laughs> I'm wearing this for a laugh actually, because you know tomorrow is 38 days since one of the battles of Hungary. 38 years. 38 years, well, thank you, you know, you know, I'm, no good. You know I'm no good with numbers, John. <laughs> uh, 38 years, yes, I'm wearing it today because this is a site, I'm wearing it because the working class need to go to work, that's why they call them the working class, the clues in the name. What it is, last time the miners and the working class tried to rebel, they got some serious truncheon, some serious fist, some serious boot and some serious... Uh, bumped into it, horses and trodden and that, uh, trampled. I mean, ah, and this right. is a very, this is sending clear message out for the RMT. 
and the work and the working class, their RMT they get enough money. They only work 37 and a half hours a week. How much do they fucking want? And let me tell you this and all. Any of the working class come out to work back and we'll be sending the police in again and you get some fucking more. Get to work, you idle fuckers. Good morning. Thanks, John.